okay y'all oh my god my hair is like connecting to everything okay so what i'm gonna do <laughs> y'all like uh prevented to not have volume and that's what i'm like wow so i prevented not to have <laughs> as much volume and it, it still happened it's okay beautiful people so today what i'm gonna show y'all is how to crimp your hair okay boom look at this look at this um a lot of people has a lot have a lot of names for it and what i'm gonna call it is mermaid hair because i know ariel's hair wasn't like this but a lot of people love to name this type of crimped hair look um a mermaid look so that's what i'm gonna call it I can achieve this look by the simple steps I show y'all and I really hope you all enjoy this video please subscribe comment like before I begin I want to say this because I forgot to mention it in my videos so since I do have long hair and this was the size of my crimper if you if you all have the ones that have three or four it's so much better resourceful beneficial because this i have to keep going and going and by the way you guys i hit 100 subscribers i love y'all so much for everyone who subscribed i really do appreciate it since i do have long um thick hair but the thing is my strands are fine so it can hold a curl but it'll hold a curl then it will like loosen up to a wave but for it to have a longer hold i love to spray on hairspray this is a kerasos liqueur extreme don't know how to pronounce it um i'm sorry it's in french i think i think they're french people but this hairspray it will hold on longer um and it's amazing this hairspray is very amazing also with the heat if you have fragile hair um you already know how you if you already know how your hair is please don't put a lot of heat on it and don't keep it on your hair for a really long time me i keep the heat on just a little bit longer because i know my hair is not going to burn off and that's just on my my end but to each his own everyone is different because it holds on i already sprayed hairspray earlier so um i don't want to keep spraying on a lot that's why i sprayed on a little bit just so y'all can get a visual of what to do and also how you section it all just depends if you want if you want a lot when you section your hair um grab thinner pieces but if you want um if you don't want much just some crimping you can like go lower and like do a thicker section it's all in your preference preference and how you want your style to be remember y'all to keep the second part look to keep the shape of the crimp go like that oops that fell out how to go go like that because <laughs> you don't want it to fall out trust me because if you stretch it out it's what was the point of it you know oops i forgot that pen. you know what i'm just gonna have to go over that part on itself because it was too much hair And what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to bobby pin it for it to get out of my freaking way because it's annoying me already. Um, I'm 
make sure when you're placing the bobby pins put it on where it's dented not where it's like wavy because then it just mess up the pattern i guess i hope that's the correct term mm -hmm. Let's go. And when I see like a part that isn't crimped all the way as I want to, I just go over it again. Because that will irritate me. Especially in the front, y'all. Because that's what you see. And that's what I like a lot of others will see. So, so y'all. So when I did the video and everything, one thing I did forget was to um, do an ending video. And I didn't realize that till now while I was editing. And I was like, wow, well, I already washed out my hair. It's not crimped anymore. But I just want to let y'all know that that is the end of my video. And, you know, stay tuned for more videos. And I hope you all loved it. And I'm so sorry for this. I don't normally do this. But, yeah, I love y'all so much, and stay tuned for the next video. Mwah.